I'm Dr. David Puchukul, a neurosurgeon at Banner Boswell Medical Center. Deep brain stimulation, or DBS, is a neurosurgical procedure for the treatment of Parkinson's disease and other movement disorders. DBS is considered an option only when all the medication options have been exhausted. Certain medications may help patients suffering from Parkinson's disease, but after three to five years, many patients no longer respond to the medications and symptoms return. Medication regimens for Parkinson's disease can have varying side effects like nausea, low blood pressure, and dyskinesia, which causes involuntary and often jerky movements of the arms, legs, and head. When the side effects and in ineffectiveness of the medication outweigh the benefits, surgery may be the only viable option for advanced Parkinson's disease. In DBS, a small electrode is planted into a specific part of the brain known as subthalamic nucleus. It is then hooked up to a pacemaker-like device called a neurogenerator. This device uses high frequencies to stimulate a very specific part of the brain to treat the disease. The procedure performed with stereotactic frame, image guidance, and is completely computerized to ensure absolute precision. Along with Parkinson's disease, DBS is being used to treat other neurological disorders and certain psychiatric diseases. These include essential tremor, dystonia, and obsessive compulsive disorder, and potential future use in the treatment of obesity. Possible significant risks of DBS include infection, localized stroke, and hemorrhage. So if all of your medication options have been explored, talk to your neurologist about deep brain stimulation.